Grade 3, Math, Lesson 6, Even and Odd. Today I'm going to discuss with you the difference between even and odd. When you're counting, there's odd numbers and there's even numbers. And it's almost like you're skip counting because on the odd side, you would go from 1 to 3 to 5 to 7 to 9 because you're skipping the even numbers. And the same thing for the even numbers. When you count by the even numbers, you're skipping the odd numbers. Now, these are always odd and these are always even. If a number ends in a zero, which should have been up here, I'm sorry, two, four, six, eight. See the zero? Zero, two, four, six, eight. If any number ends with a zero, two, four, six, or eight, it's even. If any number ends with a 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, it's odd. Look, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. Even if we got into the 20s or 30s, it would still end with a 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, and those would be the odd numbers. Now, the way you can tell if a number is even or odd is an even amount of numbers, you will see them line up like this. They'll each have pairs. This one's got this one as a friend, and this one's got this one as a friend. Odd numbers, somebody doesn't have a friend. See that? They're friends, but this one doesn't have one. So when you're adding, you can actually look at what happens. When you add an even number to an even number, you get an even number. Two, that's even because they both have friends, plus four, that's even because that one has a friend and that one has a friend equals 6. And these all have friends. See? Let's try it again. An even number 4 plus an even number 8 equals an even number 12. That's 4. See how they each have a friend? That's 8. They each have a friend. And 12. They each have a friend. So an even number plus an even number is going to give you an even number. So now look at this. An odd number plus an odd number gives you an even. What do you think of that? If you have 3, see it's got a friend, but that one doesn't, so it's odd, plus 1, that one definitely doesn't have a friend, is an even number. See how they each have a friend? An odd number plus an odd number gives you an even number. 5, this last one doesn't have a friend, and neither does this one. 5 plus 3 equals 8, but these all have friends. So an odd number plus an odd number is an even number. Now what happens if we add an odd and an even? 3, that one doesn't have a friend, plus 2, that one does have friends, equals an odd number. 5 is an odd number. See how this one's left over? 5 plus 6 equals 11. 5, that one's missing its friend, plus 6 is even because they each have a friend, is an odd number of 11. So not only does it not have a friend here, but it ends in a 1. And remember what I said? If it ends in a 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, it's odd. And if it ends in a 0, 2, 4, 6, or 8, it's even. So if you were skip counting by 2s, all the ones that are circled in pink are even numbers. 0, 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14. The ones in between, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, 11, 13, and the next one would be 15 over here, wouldn't it? Those would all be odd. So, you can skip count and tell which ones are even or odd. Just remember, starting with 1, it's odd. You can think it's odd that it's by itself, and then that'll get you started with the other odd numbers, 1, 3, 5, 7, 9, is what they end with, and 0, 2, 4, 6, 8 is the evens. So that's even and odd. You can try skip counting by 2s, 3s, 4s, 5s, or enter any number you want. You can skip count by 10. You could skip count by 100. Try to figure out which ones are even and which ones are odd. That's our lesson today. I'll see you for our next one. Bye.